Good morning, family, and welcome to today's Lessons for Life. Today is Wednesday, July 22nd, 2009, and today we're reading in 1 Kings chapter 5. And before I begin, uh, I encourage you, as always, to read it for yourself, see what you get from it. Email us, and we will put it on the blog. But this chapter, I'm going to bring up two uh, points for Lessons for Life in this chapter. And the first being that uh, you see Solomon saying that, you know, the Lord has given him rest from his um, enemies and from you know being in strife or fighting with anyone and one thing you can see that he doesn't just now sit back and relax because you know he doesn't have anybody to fight but now he says okay well now let me build something for the Lord so one lesson definitely we can get from this is you know when things seem to be going smoothly for us it's not time for us to just uh, sit back and relax but also to but for us to actually uh, have more time to be productive and to, to do work as we see Solomon is doing here too, like I said, and he could have he could have just chose to sit back. He had uh, plain riches and everything else, but he decided, well, this is the time now for me to actually put more effort and more work towards uh, building something for the Lord. And now, in addition to that, you see he enters into a, a relationship with Hiram, and the second lesson for life I want to bring up is just how they're able to have a successful relationship working together. It's not a one-sided relationship because uh, Solomon is getting uh, the logs and the uh, materials and so forth to build uh, what he's building and in return he's giving them uh, food and oil. So their relationship is one where they're both giving and they're both receiving which is actually how a relationship should be. It shouldn't be a one-sided thing where just one person is continually giving and the other one is just continually receiving but this time that you give and this time that you receive and that's how the relationship works together and the two can be in uh, cooperation together. So that was the second lesson for life that I wanted to share. Just how you know Solomon um, has this, this productive relationship here and uh, an agreement that he's entered into with uh, Hiram. So with that, that is today's lesson for life. Create yourself a wonderfully blessed day today and we'll talk again tomorrow.